Hello everyone. I am Daksh. I am Devarsh. I am Vidit Pansadi. And today we are going to present our project It's Infrared Tunneling Heatsink. As you know, we are facing a global energy crisis as our primitive resources are being exhausted at an alarming rate. These graphs depict it very efficiently. The rate of exhaustion of resources is directly proportional to the technological advancements. On the other hand, the energy resources we are able to use are either not affordable or are exhausting. Moreover, the fossil fuels form the basis of our electricity supply even today in most parts of the globe. Global warming is also another effect of burning fossil fuels for decades. Estimates suggest that we don't have enough energy to power the world ahead for a long time. To overcome this crisis, we present to you IRHTS, Infrared Heat Tunneling Sink. It is a new step into a cleaner, greener and renewable energy extraction. The physics behind the working of our project was discovered at cost. It uses the quantum tunneling of infrared particles. It says that a particle can cross a potential barrier with a lower energy than the minimum required energy to cross it. To understand further, a diode is an electrical component which allows current to flow in one direction only. In the experiment, infrared photons were made to pass through MIM diodes and these rectified the infrared photons to electric current by passing electrons through the diode and hence generating a net output voltage. So the point being quantum tunneling of infrared photons can create electricity in a much cleaner way with acceptable efficiency. If put to right use, this can pave the way to the future and meet the energy expectations and demands of the whole population. And that's what the project is about. A good source of infrared radiations is the sun. But more amazingly, we can also use the heat from the engines of an aircraft as our source to generate electricity. Thermal imaging technology has shown us that the infrared radiation from the aircraft's engine can actually solve the global energy crisis. MIM units can be installed with the engine itself. When the engine heats up, it radiates infrared waves and these can be captured by our MIM diodes generating electricity and also cooling down the engine a bit, reducing the load of cryogenic systems. It might seem that the thermodynamics break here, but it is not the case. The diodes work as a heat sink or put simply, it is an object with lower energy or temperature than the source itself and the source in this case is the engine. According to calculated estimates, if these units are packed in an area of unit square meter, 500 watts of electrical power can be captured by them. This gives an equivalent of 34.5 units of electrical energy per hour which can be generated by an average aircraft. A single engine can power almost six average Indian households for a day by just an hour of operation. The only requirement of this project to come to real life is the large scale production units for nano fabrication of IR antenna, which requires precision alignment to capture IR more efficiently. But with the drastic improvement in the precision of nano scale manufacturing over the past few years, we can make the dream of the world with surplus energy come true much sooner. That's all we have to tell about our project IRHTS or Infrared Heat Tunneling Sink. Hope to make this a future vision a reality. Like and share this video to as many people as possible.